What is up, what's up, what is up, FS Club? Welcome back to the channel. Well, Tuesday is here, and well, here in the Midwest, guys, it is cold. Eight degrees where I'm at. What is it where you guys are at right now? Well, you know what? Before we begin, make sure you guys put in the comment section below, hashtag FS Daily News. Let's roll that intro and let's get into this news. Here we go. Okay, welcome back, guys. Okay, of course, the first thing we'll be going over is, of course, that testing list for today. So on PC, we got the Alpha 2.1, the big prefab package, Crawford Farms, Cultivator C, V, A, C, N, Dog 65, Phil Hud Extension, Fork Pushing Surratt, Garage, Griffin, Indiana 19, Italian Rice XL, Cargoling Vector 46620, Crone TX 560D, Laberve L538 Forester, the Lizard D20, the Lizard T870 Skid Steer, Mammute PM 4.0A, Mossy Ferguson 7600, Maze, Mesco Z133, Metaltech WP8, Navaz 9509 Logging Truck, Nordic, OBE PX12550, Pallet Order, Petite France, Player Pays for Crop Destruction, Record KMR 2400L Evo++, Ribiri RS 100 RB, Rubajet, Sorted Shop, South Piranha, Speed Limit Restriction Signs, Star ST Max 150 180, Storage Building, Weight Station, White House, and last but not least is the Wilson Pace Setter 50 foot. So that was on the PC side. Now on consoles, we got British Animal Husband Replaceables, Bucks County PA, which is still in testing. Wow. Flowers Deco Pack, Howard Top Block Console, Jens Ham A21 Chipper Truck, the John Deere 1870 Air Ho Drill, the John Deere 750A, the John Deere CA50 Air Cart. The John Deere CCS 2113. The Coon VB 2190 with attachment to Urchis C586. Lee Razil Door Nord. The Lizard 9509. Lizard Low Loader. Lizard Tresla Cyber Squad. Metal Sheds. Pickett 1969 Brazil. Placeable Old Ramp. Placeable U.S. speed limit signs. Planner. The Russell Mash Power Stream 900. The Shooting Maker Vertical Pack. Seasons Geo South Morvea. The TLX 48 foot enclosed trailer. The TLX 48 foot tanker trailer. The TLX 9000 Rigid Series. The TLX 9000 Semi. And last but not least, the Vorperman Rugen. I believe that's how you say that. Now, miles we're going to be tested is 56. So we're almost under that 50 mark. I wonder if at the end of this week, if we'll actually be under that. Current engine temp, guys, is only three workdays. So that is the testing list for today. And now on to the regular news for today. Let's see. The first one we have is from Blue Agent Modding. And this is, of course, on his John Deere 6R US series, which has now been sent to the mod up. Some features, front weights, beacon lights, front fenders, protection grid, 100 year celebration stickers, Starfire 6000 options, animated door and windows, foldable side indicators, and two types front loader attachers, type one for in-game 643R and type two for the H480 made by custom modding. So that is on the John Deere 6R he is bringing to the mod up for all platforms. And now the next one is from Retro Mods. This is the Hay Buster. He had this to say, got a lot more detail done to it. Now he only has to model the bail loader, the right sidewalls and the lights on that. That looks amazing right there. Can't wait for that one. This will be coming to all platforms too. 
And then the next one after that is from Peter716. He is actually bringing out a new map that will be coming out to all platforms. This is Greenlands. As you see, if he already tested it himself, uh, he has sent it over to the Mod Hub, and he's actually sent us an early preview copy, which I will have the first look actually out tomorrow. So hopefully you guys stay tuned in for that. Okay, Peter716 also has another update too. And this is on the Animal Placeable Pack. Yeah, this is a, I have just sent it off to Giants for testing. These are the ones from the New Park Farm and the Greenland, so you can place them on any map you want to. Should be for both PC and console uh, Giants permitting. The change log on it though, change name from a British cow, sheeps, pigs, placeable to British animal husbandry placeable, edit pigs husbandry large and beef cattle husbandry, uh, changed and improved store icon images, and also fixed a few small things on that. So that is everything from Peter716. Okay, and then after that one, we have something from Stoneway Design. Yes, they are back, but he has been working on a new mod. This is the Brent Grain Train 1000. Uh, he has took a few pictures, uh, a few more things left to do with it, and it should be sent out for testing. Uh, but these pictures look amazing on it. And then after that one, we have a little bit of tease from White Bull Modding. He had this to say, no time to stop, already working on a new project. Who can guess what this is? A lot of people are thinking this is an international. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section below. What do you guys think that this tractor that they are building is? Okay, now on to the last piece of news, which is from Sluchus Modding. Here it is right here. There, this is say, working hours in the field is not always good. We have to have some time to have some fun with other things. Look guys, what's next? As you guys can see from these pictures, looks like we're about to get a go-kart and farming simulator. Uh, this thing is gonna be interesting. Can't wait for this. Hopefully this does come out to all platforms too. Okay, so that right there, guys, was all the news, the mods and testing. That was everything for today. Now, today's schedule after this video, of course, will come out the new mod video, which new mods have came out. And then, of course, tonight at 7 p.m., I will be doing a first look on Richport. So hopefully you guys do stay tuned in for that. Like always, if you guys did like the video, make sure you guys do pound that like button. If you haven't sudden, make sure you guys do like always. Have an all day, farmers. Peace.